Hey guys, it's ZD here and I am super excited to be going over something today that maybe you are struggling with right now. And it's what so many people are struggling with because they just don't get what they want in life. You know, there's so many people out there with such good intentions. You know, they write their goals down over and over again. They listen to their mentors or videos online and they're like, I really want to become successful. But the truth of the matter is, why is it that majority of people do not become successful? Why do people not have the relationship of their dreams? Why do people not have the money of their dreams? Why do people just not, you know, get their health on track? You know, it doesn't matter what you're motivated for. And that's not what this video is all about. I want to give you an exact plan on how to make your dreams a reality. But it's not the sexy thing that you want to hear. And I can promise you right now, becoming successful is not an easy journey. But I can tell you it's worth it. And I can tell you when you get to the end of whatever you're going for and you have that thing that you've always wanted in your hands, it is so worth it. But why is it most people don't have that? Why is it most people set their goals on New Year's Eve and within a week, two weeks, they're not going to the gym. You know, they're not going for what they're really wanting. And it's because you live in a program. I look at human beings like you're a human being, but you are living out a program. It's an unconscious program that is already programmed in from past experiences, you know, significant emotional events you went through in your life, patterns that you're running every single day. And you've got all of this baggage that you're holding on to that you're, you feel comfortable with. Just like if someone's broke, it's not that they want to be broke. Your heart wants more. It wants to grow. It, the soul wants to expand. But the reason it doesn't is because this thing, the mind is programmed. It's hardwired for comfort. So even when someone's broke, they're actually comfortable being broke. And I know that might be hard to hear for you, but it's the truth. You know, you're normalized yourself with those stress hormones. You've normalized yourself by waking up every day saying, how am I going to pay for this? You've straight, you've literally addicted to those emotions. And because you're addicted, to them, you just keep playing out the same reality over and over again. But then New Year's Eve comes or a goal setting workshop comes and you write your goals down. But why isn't it a week later? Nothing changes. Because if we want to change our life, we have to change our programming. And there's one thing that I absolutely know from being in this industry for 11 years, like helping people in personal development, you have to change your habits. And habits over and over again over time, you know, rituals that you're doing consciously over time form into unconscious habits or programs. So if I want to start manifesting what I want in my life, well, I know I have 70,000 thoughts every day and everyone else has 70,000 thoughts every day. So my goal in life is to change the 70,000 thoughts because the 70,000 thoughts that broke persons have in every day is thinking, how am I going to achieve this? Oh, it's too hard. Or That's already governed in. It's already programmed in. But if I get that broke person to start saying, hey, close your eyes, change your habits right now. Instead of just writing down the goal, I want you to close your eyes. I want you to breathe your brain and heart connected. And I want you to start visualizing, getting the pictures and start focusing on what you truly want. Not what you got last year, not what you got the year before, but what do you really want? And you start marinating in that. You start feeling into that. What would it feel like to have the dream relationship? What would it feel like to have the money? And you start changing and interrupting those programs inside. You'll come out of the visualization or whatever and you'll be like, I feel amazing. But you can't do something once and think your life's going to change. You've just did a good workout. If you do a meditation or visualization, you're changing your programming for the moment. But if you tomorrow are like, oh, I'm tired, I don't want to do that visualization today, well, guess what? You're going to go back to the same old program. That's why I built the method, the six times a day method, and I'll put it below here. You can have it for free, where I give you a five-minute track where you can listen to over and over again, six times a day throughout the day, every three hours, and you're going to keep interrupting those 70,000 thoughts. Now, if you do this, not for a day, not for a week, not for a month, but if you do it for a six to eight week period, you're going to start changing your thought process every day. And you're going to start embodying who you really want to be until it becomes automatic. You know, when someone is making money and they're consistently making money, you look at someone like, that person just makes always money. They've just programmed themselves to make money. 
That's all I did in my business. All I did was I just pre-programmed myself inside month on month on month on month to make money. So my whole entire subconscious program is normalized to making money. Just like the person that's broke is struggling to make money, the person that has money can't not make money because they're just in that program. The 70,000 thoughts are already automatic. It's a habit. But you have to stay for the long run. You have to get that momentum. And we're living in a world where there's so many different opportunities out there. You listen to one person and they say, you've got to work your ass off, you've got to hustle. Then you listen to someone else and like, you just got to meditate, you just got to visualize. But it's really, we're getting pulled in so many directions, but the truth is you just got to change your programming. That's all you've got to do. Everything else after that becomes more effortless and easy. You know, I've been training in the gym for probably 15 years, so I don't need to think every day, I need to go to the gym today. It just, it just happens, it's automatic. Why? Because it's a subconscious program. It's a habit. A habit is when it's formed into the subconscious mind, just like cleaning your teeth, you know, having a shower. You do those things probably unconsciously. You don't need to think about it. You know, you're going to clean your teeth. But what is a ritual is taking the time in a morning routine to really focus and say, okay, I've got to visualize what I want. You have to use all all of your mental conscious focus. And when you do that over and over again, being conscious, it'll start becoming automatic. That's why I get people to meditate six times a day to reprogram their mind. You know, and eat especially right before you go to sleep. Because think about it, right when you go to sleep, 4% of your mind is conscious. 96% of your mind is subconscious. So right when you go to sleep, your subconscious mind doesn't sleep. You know, your conscious mind sleeps to relax your entire system. So you go to sleep, you go into your dream world, you let your subconscious mind take over. So what you place right into your mind right before you go to sleep is so incredibly crucial. Would you agree? Because yeah, because you're you're gonna marinate in whatever you're focused on. So if you're focusing on, I can't pay the bills, you're know, never gonna be successful, like why is these things not happening? I'm gonna go to the gym tomorrow and all these doubtful things. Well, the first thing that's gonna happen is you're just gonna marinate with that all night. And then you're gonna wake up feeling the same program. But if you can start interrupting and using that state of mind right before you go to sleep, you're about to sleep and you program what you truly want into your mind, it's gonna start forming. And if you do it for a six to eight week period or even just a 21 day, you're gonna start seeing a com- incredible difference in your life, the way you show up, you know? So I really want you to get clear on, if I wanna become successful, the only thing I gotta do is start to change my habits. I gotta focus on one goal that I want, not 50 goals that I want. I wanna focus on one goal that I want. So let's just say I want to get my dream body. You know, I want to have a certain amount of money coming in. I want to attract a dream relationship. That's my goal and that's what I'm gonna focus on. My intention is on that. And then the next thing I gotta clear on is, what are the new habits that I need to change every single day? Well, the first habit that I'd be changing is how I see myself. You know, what am I placing in my mind? Because if I really want this relationship, I need to visualize this relationship. Tell my brain over and over again, use focus. You know, all the great teachers always said, what you focus on expands. So if you focus on your broke bank account, it's going to expand. If you focus on attracting your dream relationship, it's going to expand. You know, and our brain can't tell the difference between what we imagine and what we experience. So if you can start telling yourself, I've already got the relationship and you feel into it, how would it feel to look into that person's eyes and connect with? Well, over time, that's what's gonna start manifesting into your reality. That's what the law of attraction is. You know, if you watch my previous videos, I go really deep on the law of attraction and really how it actually works. Because when you understand that you, every thought that you're having is starting to create changes in the physical world, you'd be very, very conscious on what you start putting into your mind. You know, but most people are just unconscious about it. I'll just live out tomorrow's yesterday's reality, yeah, it's another 12 months and then you start feeling guilty, then you start feeling bad and you're like, why isn't things changing for me? So you have to change. You have to get clear on what you want. Then you have to start marinating on it every single day. You know, and what we've created for this is I have a 21 day challenge where I usually give this to my clients, you know, people that are working with us and they come, they pay $47 and they go through this challenge where you write down one goal that you want to achieve, just like the relationship one, the money one, whatever it is you want. Be selfish with the goal, whatever it is for you, but just choose one goal. And then what you do is every single day, 
to form a habit, because that's going to change the program, you write down, do you answer questions about that goal? So we've given you, you get a workbook where you write down your goal and then every single day you've got to probably take two to five minutes out of your day to write down the answers to the questions on what actions you're going to take. You know, what are you going to take? What actions are you going to take to move towards this goal? And then whilst you're doing that, do, there's a track you've got to listen to for 11 minutes every single day that will get you into the right frame of mind. You can listen to this once. You can also do the six times a day method below to add to it. But if you can do this for 21 days, literally take 15 to 20 minutes out of your day every single day for 21 days, the momentum that you will build will be crazy. And you won't be another person that just goes through another year, because trust me, 21 days goes really quick. Haven't you realized? Another 21 days will go quick. Another 21 days. And, you're, and then it's the next, next year. You know, it's late 2023, you know? So we've got to be very good with our time and stop getting swayed everywhere and start being focused somewhere. You know, we need to focus on something. So what I want to do for the next 30 days, if you watch this video for the next 30 days, I'm going to have a link below with a code and a coupon code that you can get access to the 21 day challenge for free. Because I want to help you out in the greatest way possible. But if you're going to do this, I want you to be fully in. Don't be one of those people in life that says, oh yeah, I'm going to try it out or whatever. No, do it for 21 days. You know, hopefully you can do it for 21 days and then it's 21 days goes, do another 21 days and you just keep growing and growing and growing because it's not one thing you do and then everything changes. It's what you do every single day that changes everything. So guys, if you want this, hit the link below. You'll see the link for it. You can join my 21 day challenge. You also get access to a Facebook group, which I can see you in there and that can make, maybe be the starting process of you really changing your life because pro I can promise you your life will change if you start changing your thinking if you start focusing and being a person that just really has a harness focus not one that just keeps checking their phone over and over but you just have unbelievable focus your life will absolutely change so guys this is why most people aren't successful they don't change their programming they aren't conscious they think writing down goals is magically going to change if you write down goals every day it might change because you're changing you're turning into a ritual which will lead into a habit so guys, that's my message for you right now. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, please share it out. Like, subscribe on this, um, and you'll see a lot more of my videos coming out. There's meditations, there's different videos on here, so check out my channel. Guys, have an incredible day, and I'll talk to you all very soon.